So we went on a little road trip today to a collectibles kind of card store, I guess. They had more vintage toys and stuff, but they had some cards, wanted to check it out. And this is a hilarious story that turned into an amazing find. Okay, so let's just show you what I got at the first store. Spoiler alert, there's more. Okay. Um, George Bell rookie card. Some of these prices are not uh, what they were. They were in like a $2 bin and there was a sale, no tax, etc. So this is for somebody that I know that it'll be a gift for. Uh, this was the only bossy card that I don't have uh, from his base card run. Uh, a Steve Shutt rookie card. This was five. I think it was four fifty. It's uh, I mean it's it's okay, pretty good. Clark Gillies, nicely centered rookie card. He just passed away. Yeah, twelve bucks. I think I paid ten. And I got a bunch of Rogie Vashon cards. I don't even really know why. I just I kind of like the old goalies. Okay, so the story is, and that's all I got from the, uh, from that store. Actually, I'll show one more thing. This probably won't even fit in the camera screen, but I got this. <laughs> this giant Godzilla, um, for my son is a huge fan. He doesn't watch my videos, so he doesn't know that'll be coming for a future gift. Okay, so the guy that owned the store, there was an antique store across the street from this shop. And I asked the guy if, if the guy across the street had any uh, sports cards, and he said no. Not really, maybe a little bit. So anyway, we finally went across the street, and I asked the owner if he had any sports cards, or if there was any sports card vendors. Uh, there's a bit of a... There's a bunch of vendors there too, like antique market style. Anyway, he said, yeah, there's a little bit, but then he pulls out this box from behind or from under his cabinet. It wasn't even for sale yet. Now there was actually two boxes. The first box was just this front pile. And right away I'm like, let me just move this other box. Right away, I'm like, holy shit. Look at the condition, you know, of these cards. There's a couple minor creases if you look close, but these cards look great. Now, I'm sitting there looking at this box, and I'm just eyeing it up. You know, I'm scrolling through the first couple cards. I'm like... Okay, this is going to be amazing. So I scrolled through a bunch of the cards. I didn't even notice that was an Andy Bathgate rookie card. Anyway, we're going to go through all of these because I just kind of flipped through them. Um, I'm sitting there thinking, man, if I leave this store without buying all of this somehow, but I didn't want to overpay. So anyway, I asked the guy how much for this first kind of pile here. I don't know if there's like 150 cards. And he says, I think 150. I'm like, okay, well, put that aside. I'll probably end up taking that. And then I came back and I was like, how much for all of it? I want all of it. And he, I said, I'll give you 600 bucks for everything. And he said, sure, 600 bucks cash for both boxes. Yeah. Now, let's go through all of these cards and see what's in here. I flipped through a couple times and I saw just a couple of the good cards and I was sold. So I'm just going to flip through these. I mean, look at the backs. Uh, there's prices on these. I think he got these all at auction and he was going to put them out to sell. I mean, they're so bright. I mean, I do see a couple creases on these, but these are uh, 1970, 71. Pretty much all base in here, but or I should say common there's a I think they call this guy suitcase no that's Gary 
Al Smith, but those cool uh, old goalies. Yeah. So you have to flip through these. I think the other box has more of the better cards. There's a nice Brad Park. I didn't like this set very much before, but it's been growing on me lately. I think some of these are tops. Yeah, but I don't care. Tops, OPG, whatever. There's Stan Makita. There's another one, better shape. Tops, Tony Esposito. That's a really cool card. I actually have, I just bought this card yesterday at some other place. Rod Gilbert. I mean, there's a lot of good names in here. What's going? That's the first little stack. Some more of these uh, trophies, then some more of these 1970s. Pretty good. There's Ken Hodge. There's a uh, suitcase, Gary Smith. Yeah. So now. I think, like, I've been looking at antique shops for a while, you know, I found that tin of cards that was sort of beat up, but fun. This is, like, the pinnacle of my findings. Okay, so I'm going to go with the other big box now. There's a second year bossy, and it's it's funny, it says pack fresh. Yeah, maybe it is, but look at the, uh, the centering on that, baby. Still awesome. Unmarked checklist from 72. I mean, this thing is crisp. Tops. There's a price tag on the back. There's a 71, 72 uh, marked Tops card. Uh, Bobby Clark, 74, 75, I think. Yep. A little bit off center, but there's a mark on it too. Some scoring leader, uh, Bruin, or the league leaders. Bobby Orr's on there. Bill Gadsby, 1958, wow. We have a, a Jim Henry and the Andy Bathgate rookie card. That's pretty cool. Looks trimmed. Uh, what year are these? Uh, 62, 63, there's a Retai, John Retai. I'm not sure if that's his rookie card or not. We have Bello, uh, Bellows, Boom Boom, Jeffrey on, Bellavo, and uh, Don Marshall. It's got a crease. I uh, can't remember what year that is. 61, 62. Kent Nielsen rookie card. There's a beat up Gretzky card there. <laughs> it's funny. Second year card. Then we have some of these uh, 65, 66 cards. Ralph Backstrom. I'm gonna, yeah, I'll do that after. We have some, what year are these? These are 68, 69. We have a Jacques Laperriere. Uh, yep, just a few, I'm not sure, commons, I guess. Couple, yeah, a couple of these are all peaches. A couple of those are tops. We have a Lafleur from 74, 75. Pierre Bouchard, Larry Robinson. Not even halfway through this box. Uh, I think these are 69.70. There's a nice Bellavo. And a nice Bobby Hall All Star. There's a Henry Richard. Trump Rosley. Ted Green. Okay, now we have some 73, 74. I think these are tops. The blue is in tops, I believe. Oh, these are goalies. There's Stan Makita. It's a nice one. Yep. Yeah, no, some of these are Opeachy. Richard Martin. 
I'm not sure if that's his rookie card, maybe. Probably not. No, I think it's 71. I have another Jacques Plant here. That's pretty cool. Mm. 71, 72 tops. Goalie leaders. There's a Jacques Plant, a Jacques, uh, Jacquemin, and Esposito. Mm, some more 71, 72s. Some, there's Busick Perot. I think, again, mostly tops. Esposito. There's Brad Park. A couple of those. Tony Esposito, Henry Richard, Stan Makita. Yeah, that's a pretty cool bunch of names. There's Richard Martin. No totals. I think that's his uh, rookie card there. Reggie Leach. Could it be his rookie card? I think it is. Yeah, it's, uh, he's got them in the rookie thing. That must be a rookie card. Okay, now we're going to some more 70, 71s. A little bit rough, some of these, but there's a Bobby Orr that I'm happy to see. It's beat up, but whatever. Phil Esposito. I might, I might uh, put those all together. Yvonne Cornwallier, Backstrom, Lemaire, Lemaire. There's a Brad Park rookie card. There's Gary Smith. I think that's, nope, not his rookie card. Ernie Wakeley. Yeah, these old cards, I love, uh, I love these cards. Frank Mahovlich, there's Phil Goyette, there's another Phil Esposito. Um, I got about a third or more-ish. Cornway, John Ferguson. I think there's a bunch of 72, three here. Ken Dryden, second year card. A little miscut on the bottom, still cool. There's a Stan Makita. Marcel Dion, second year card. Tops card, Jacques Lemaire. Yeah, see, some of these cards are really sharp. I mean, there's a little bit of a print thing going on, but pretty happy with that. Uh, so this is what I was really happy to see, these next few. This is a second year Lafleur, another and another three second year Lafleurs, pretty sweet. Three of those. There's a, a Dryden uh, All Star card. That's cool. There's a Frank Mahovlich. We're still going. We got more. <laughs> Uh, what are these? These are like 68, 69s. I think these are mostly common cards. Pretty awesome. Stan Makita. There's Del Vecchio. Ted Green. few more. Looks like they're all in team uh, order. What else do we have here? Howie Young. When I first saw that, I thought it was Gordie Howe. <laughs> yeah, I like this design too. It's kind of cool. Unique. I like the older, like all the older cards, they have different unique designs. They're all fun. So we're getting down to the end. Rod Gilbert, it's got to be close to his rookie year. I don't think so, but maybe $7. No, it can't be. 
Yeah, and that's it. There's one more card. It is a tall boy of Milt Schmidt. Yep, and that's all. So super happy with this find. I mean, obviously. I'm gonna keep some of these cards and I'm gonna sell some to offset the price. I think this is the best 600 bucks I've spent in a long time. All right, so lots of uploads coming. Stay tuned.